You're getting the latest secret info on Jewish music here on Jewish Hack. Welcome to the Secret Info Show. We have a ton of huge news this week, so be sure to watch to the end of this week's episode 9. Mordechai Shapiro has been working on his new album quite a bit lately. There is no album release date yet, but take a look at this. After 10 hours in the studio today, it's time to eat dinner. Check one, two, one, two. We ready. We ready to go. Morty also said something about a new music video, which has just come out. Now sing it like this. What's up, everybody? Happy Wednesday. I'm here back in Kew Garden Hills getting my haircut from Emmanuel. What's up? We're getting ready for a big shoot tomorrow. Big news. I'm telling you here on the uh, haircut chair. I'm shooting a new music video tomorrow that's coming out really soon. Now you got it. called ABBA and is doing quite well already. Usually music videos that come out with the album are done really close to the album release date. What do you think? Is this the video that comes out with the album, meaning the album is around the corner? Or is this just a single and music video coming out before the album release? This is crazy because Mordechai literally just released the Singed album with Freilich Band and now he's already getting ready for another album. Now we've been talking about Uri Davidi coming out with an album for a long time. He's way overdue for one, but we still had no confirmation that he was even working on it. But now, finally, Uri Davidi has now announced that he is officially working on his next album. How you guys doing today? We're out here in Woodmere about to start a wedding. Before we begin, I want to share with you guys some amazing news. Breaking news, you're going to hear it here first. I want to let you guys know that we are working on a brand new album. Yes, a brand new album. Super exciting. I got these headphones on, all ready to go. A brand new album with 10, 11, 12, I don't even know yet how many brand new songs that we're gonna share with you. He says he would like to release it in the winter sometime before Pesach and he's super excited for it. So, look out in the coming months for more information that I'm gonna share with you guys. I hope this album will be out somewhere dead in the middle of the winter before Pesach so we can have some brand new material for Pesach and stay tuned. And I am super, super, super excited for this album in particular because I have some beautiful, heartwarming, exciting, fun songs to share with you guys. And I know you're going to enjoy them. So, Ezra Hashem, very, very soon you will hear more. And in the next couple months, we will have a full brand new album out for you to enjoy. So keep on streaming the songs that are out now and look out for music. Jewish Hawk predicts that the album will likely end up getting released sometime between Hanukkah and Purim, and we predict a music video coming along around the same time. Is Abram Fried working on an album? Watch the end to find out. Yoni Z is another singer who has been working on his new album, which is getting closer to being released. It seems like the album is going to be released sometime this winter, and Yoni has even shared a sneak peek of it. Everyone sends me videos that they don't actually hear anything that's coming out from the album. Should we play them something? Yoni also recorded with a choir for the album, which likely means vocals are almost done from him. Singers often don't record the choir until they finish their own vocals, so it's a sign that the album is making progress and is around the corner. Are you getting excited yet? My people, what's going on? Not to overhype this, but this album, it's not done yet, but if I do say so myself, I can't wait to share this. I mean, this is nuts. Joey Newcomb is already working on a new album. Take a look. If you just would taste it a little bit. We predict the album to come out towards the end of the year, a little before the summer. Joey is known to blow everyone away with new music, and we predict a new music video to come together with the album as well. So how much work it takes to get it right for me to, you know, get a double album out. So I had to have a lot of songs that are, you know, pushed to the side and didn't make it on this which are great songs, but still being worked on. And maybe it won't take another three years. I hope it doesn't take another three years because I'm gonna have a head start on another one. 
Yep, Yaakov Shreki is already gearing up for his next album, which will hopefully come a lot sooner than the L'Chaim album. Liebig Schmelzer is getting ready for a new album release sometime soon, and we're expecting an update on a release date shortly. It does seem like Michal Przanski might be working on a new album. This hasn't been confirmed yet, but hopefully it's true, because his last album is nearing almost four years old now. Rumors are going around that the Yeshiva Boys Choir and Miami Boys Choir are working on new albums as well. This does kind of make sense, as they are both due for an album, and they usually release something every few years. That being said, these are just rumors, so we'll have to see if they get confirmed. David Perlman's Shira Shabalev music video should be just around the corner. It's predicted that it will come around Hanukkah time, but it may have already been filmed that David is just waiting for the perfect time to release it. One big question going around is, when will W. Shapiro release his debut album? Will he ever release one in the first place, or will he just only release singles? W. Shapiro released two singles in a row last year. We think there's a chance that points to a new album entirely this year. But if not, we predict another single on December 31st. Dobby usually surprises us with new music and doesn't even give the slightest hint before, so you never really know. Often when singers record a bunch of singles, it can be a sign that they're already in the studio working on an album. But with Dobby, who knows? David Aziza's new single and music video, Matanot, was recently released, and we'll have to see how it does. The song and video have been well received so far. Maybe an album will come from him next? Simcha Liner has been working on her fifth album for a while. But where is it? We haven't heard any updates in recent times, or even gotten an estimated release date. So we should probably hear something any day now. Ari Goldbeck has a music video for Yeshli Yakol that he still hasn't released. It is likely to come out sometime around Hanukkah. His next album is also due around that time, and we're expecting an update on that as well very soon. Is Avram Fried releasing a new album? He hasn't released an album in quite a while, and it seems something might be in the works. Hopefully he takes a break from the list of singles, and we'll get a brand new album from him soon. Moshe Tischler has been working on a second album that is supposed to come out on the heels of his new single and music video, Abagadol. It is still in its early stages though, and we guess it'll come out sometime closer to the summer. In other news, Desperate Measures, Baruch Perlowitz's latest film, is out now, and he's already started filming Desperate Measures 2. Hey officers, what do we got? Half the situation on the fifth floor. Once again, they'll be filming in Lakewood, and the story has a number of jail scenes and some fighting in it. Can't reveal too much yet, but we'll go as we get closer to the film release date, which is coming this pace off. That was episode 9 in partnership with Smiles Media. See you next week for more.